Hi, and welcome to the second part of these videos. Today we're going to get ourselves an editor, and we will use that editor to write our own game. We're going to configure Rapanui and actually run some demos. Uh, in the end, I'm going to show you how to get the project file so that you can be able to just fix your own issues uh, if you're following along with the code that we are going to write and everything will be fun and easy. So let's get started. In order to create our game, we're going to need an editor. Uh, you can use any editor actually, but uh, I'm going to use Notepad++ because it is actually pretty good, it's free, and uh, it is really fast. If you are uh, developing the game in any other platform like Mac or anything else, you can choose your editor of choice. So you must go to the Notepad editor website and now we are going to actually download the editor. So we click on the download and I'm going to choose this option. It's a zip package. Uh, I choose this option because it is really easy to get this package, extract it and then simply run it. So let's get it, save it and let's download it in C downloads. Okay, it is done. So just cut it, go to your Urn Moai uh, directory, paste it, and just say extract here. And now we have it. So just let's uh, rename this folder. Let's call it Notepad++. Plus plus. Okay, so just come here, run it, and you have it. So now it is actually time to configure both Moai and Raponui. So just go to your Moai SDK directory, then bin, win32, and just grab those two files, copy them, go to this directory. You can have something else here, but that's just gibberish, so you don't care about it. You paste it over here. Okay, so just back up one directory and let's remove for our convenience this gibberish. Okay, so now you basically have to create a bat file that will run the both frameworks. So go to your newly installed Notepad++ editor and write the following thing. This is the exe file that we copied before. Now you're going to reference some config file from the Moai SDK. And then you have to pass in the main file that will run when uh, this bat file is executed. So you go to my computer, C drive, learn Moai, IMOPI Rapanui, and then you just write here run dot but okay so now just bring your cmd console and go to c learn moai then cd into imop rapanui and then just write in run dot bat and there you have it all is running and this is just okay.
So now we have everything running just perfectly. So let's just close this and this. And I'm going to talk uh, about uh, project files that we're going to use. But just before that, a little note to our Mac users. You can go to this URL and just scroll down to where it says developing on Mac. And here you can read all about the concepts of developing on your Mac machine. And if you have some questions, uh, post them in the comments below or just go to our website and comment there. And now about the project files. Project files are here. Um, in order to download them, you just have to go to downloads and download them as a zip. And there we go, you have them. Uh, let's just do one more thing really quickly. Just go to your Rapanui directory and let's create our folder in which we will actually create our game in the next episodes. So let's just call it my game. And that's it. In the next episode, we're going to make a deep dive into the Moai and Rapanui basics and we're going to actually write some code. So be prepared. In the meantime, you can go to our website and follow the news over there. You can also follow me on Twitter and my name is Vanilin Volkov. So that's it. Bye.